I bought an Aero Scout and crashed immediately. Look, it hit this little pole right here. Oh, it knocked the wheel off. Oh, no. We broke the one that's in here. All right, we have May. Yes, titanium metal jacket. Not doing anything. And backwards? Obviously, the first thing we have to do is unplug this one. We have to find out where it feeds in. And then I heard that this thing just comes off. Like it's just glued in there. Look at it. Might be able just to like move this back a teeny bit. Find out exactly what, which one is doing what. So what I would do is, there we go. Let's just lift it out. To make life easy. I'm not trying to stress on this right now. What's underneath there? What is that? Oh, the ESC. Cool. What we have to do is trace this one back. Where's this one? It's this one right here. All right. So this very first one, right? So we're gonna unplug this. These are wired the same, so you just gotta make sure the new one here is wired the same, but I'm pretty sure they only go one way. You know what I'm saying? Let's find out. So let's unplug this, okay? Let's pull this through. Ooh, this next one's gonna be a challenge, I can tell already. <laughs> let's push this through. And boom. Old dead ass servo. We also did pick up some Spectrum ones as well, just in case this didn't work out, but I think this is gonna be fine. I think we're gonna be all right. Look at that, titanium metal. This is the steering servo, the rudder servo. Let's see these compared to the old one. I don't know anything about this. I've never done this, first time ever doing this. Oh, they're basically the same way. Well, we're gonna find out, aren't we? I don't know what to make of this. I don't know what's gonna happen, but we're gonna bend it up. There is a Horizon Hobby video about this, about this guy doing it. So I'm just, I've already watched that, but I don't see anybody upgrading it. And I don't see anybody upgrading it when you crash with this thing. When you crash with this thing, like it hits the wheel or when you land, it's gonna be on the front wheel. So I imagine we want this stronger. No. Let's see what happens with this hole size. I think, I imagine we have to trim. So we got a trim. Holy snap. I think we gotta trim a little bit. Yeah, I think we gotta trim just a teeny bit. So what I got here to trim. Oh. What the heck? Oh, maybe not. Push it down in, there you go, look at that. Dude, that literally snapped into place. That literally snapped into place. We'll feed this through up here. What the heck? And let's see if it's right right off the bat. Feed this through here. I got some uh, other sticky tapes. And if anything, we gotta turn it around. All right, if anything is like this, but can it go this way? I think it has to go this way. Doop. Let's turn it on and see what happens. All right, it came with the 2200. Let's plug it in. Ooh. Came also with this Spectrum controller. Let's turn it on. This is disarmed. It's not doing anything. And backwards. Oh my gosh, listen to it. It works, right? Left. Look at that. This one works too. This is the factory one. All right, let's turn it off. It works. All right, I just Yay. actually put the sticky tape back on. I think it'll be all right. Feed this through. Pull up the wings. So there's plenty of length and wire. This is a local item. This is like the first thing I ever freaking paid money for on or ordered online was for a plane. It's hilarious. Nothing for a drone, but for a plane, you need to order it online. Okay. And the wings are simple. Just go on a little bar. Let's see the screws come out. So you just close the wing up. And just make sure everything's tucked in, which it is. Put the wing down. 
and it just comes with this little clip here. You only go on pretty much one way. It's pretty much possible to mess up. It is, it is possible to mess up. I think these gears are okay on the factory one. I think it'll fit right on there. Maybe it won't. Okay, much bigger. Okay, I had to modify the original. We gotta do a couple more things. We gotta put these little screws in here. And then we gotta make sure and put the screw in up in here. And then the little screw that holds it down. This is a much bigger motor. Titanium gears, a teeny bit heavier. I think it's, well, I guess it's gonna be a teeny bit heavier. We're gonna make sure this screw that holds the gears on is tight. Oh, no, 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 I didn't wanna do that. Okay, sorry, I didn't mean to do that. You gotta be careful with these things. Now we gotta put the little screws in. This is a $17 item, or I, I paid retail, I guess, for it online, but, and it is what it is, but I don't wanna drop this screw right now. This isn't gonna be the best stick cam, but here's your arm switch. Okay, throttle cut. Oh, shit, yeah. Look at this thing. Look at this thing. Look at this thing. And it's got steering. Woo! On the runway, baby. Ooh, shit. I got scared. It took a lot longer to do a runway. I actually didn't even check the CG. Whoa. Okay, so the sticks are real sensitive. But we're up in the air, man. It's fun. And we got the safe mode on. Whew. Don't wanna lose the GoPros. We're just chilling with throttle down a little bit. This would be cool to hear. Really windy today. Yeah, this nose heavy. <laughs> yeah, so this thing's fun. You can buy it. It's 200 bucks. It's ready to fly. Let's bring it in lower. Let's bring it in lower, 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 lower. It's a little nose heavy. It's definitely windy. And this is on beginner mode, so you can easily fly it. And the battery, the battery was on low. See, I'm riding the trim real heavy, real hard. And I don't know how to actually adjust it, so we're gonna try to land this thing maybe. Get one more little view. Very nose heavy. But look, you just cruise it. Look at this, just cruise it. Low throttle, no throttle. Cruising. Woo! Safe mode, dang. I can't really speak because I've never really flown one of these things. Oh shoot. Oops. This actually worked. Look at this little zip tie action. Let's fire the, the heck. Did you do? Let's ride it. Everything all right? The wheel straight came off. All right, we fixed the landing gear. Flew one more flight. That's what you're gonna see. Landed beautifully. This plane is freaking awesome for what it is. So, more plane footage, man. FPV time. We are all the way live from beautiful Southern California, out in the field with the Aero Scout. Look at the GoPro. Boom. That's how I'm gonna fly this thing right now, just so we get a little visual. Let's just figure this out. This is where I'm at. And hopefully we can do some GoPro and some stick cam. We got a little runway here. And do some landing. Let's practice real quick. This battery's not fully charged, but we're all right. Let's just test this battery because we're gonna go fly it with whatever is left inside of it. 393939, it's a 3S. Oh, shit. Oh. Yay! <laughs> we got it, we got it. That's how you 
<laughs> well, if you're driving around, you can turn the front wheel. Hey, that's the thing. Yeah, it's the wind damage on the nose, yeah. but it'll still fly. All right, let's go over to Jeff and see how he's doing. Here goes Jeff. <laughs> 